Hey everybody, Mark again here, Weatherman Plus. I got your afternoon update on a La Palma volcano. Matter of fact, I have a new map to show you where the lava flow will more likely go by the professionals of where this lava will go when it goes around that little mountain close to the edge by the sea. So that way we can see who would be more likely at risk of this lava flow and they can prepare a little early and grab your stuff and leave. Also some new information as far as the help and what's going on with the ash advisory because now it's going all the way up to 20,000 feet and I could be risking the airport again because it is blowing southeast. Now, if you've never been here before, make sure you hit that subscribe button. I do upload every single day. As a matter of fact, I'm starting to advance now into more international. I've had a lot of people tell me they want me to do their weather in their area. Lately, I've stayed just with the U.S., but now I'm going to start expanding out because I see a lot more people do need my help. Not only that, if you stick to the end of the video and hear the special message, you'll understand why it is I'm trying to reach everybody around the world. Links are always in the description to help save you time, although in a short video like today, I don't know how many links they may be. <laughs> Hit that like button if you're loving these updates, and please share this information on social media. That way people in La Palma can know exactly what's going on, and the help is out there for them, and what could be happening with this lava flow. Because now, instead of one or two flows, there's actually a third flow. Now this is your earthquake tracker for La Palma, and today you can see that right after this morning, we did have some big earthquakes, a 3.3 multiple times all morning it was starting to seem a little crazy because it started off quiet but that's still the strombolian activity is where it's going to be periods of quiet and then big eruptions then it's going to be periods of quiet again and you can see here with the latest activity as of today it started firing right back up again but then it started calming down a little bit but then it started firing right back up again and it was some pretty big explosions but now it's starting to calm back down again it looks like it's starting to go back up again Maybe later tonight, maybe it'll start erupting again. I don't think it'll be a quiet night tonight. But remember, all these things I'm showing you, the links are in the descriptions, and they do update as you refresh them. Now, there's been a lot of explosive activity as soon as the day started off today. It was quiet this morning, but just like it's going to be doing for a while now, now we've got a lot of explosive activity throughout the day, and the Volcanic Ash Advisory Center warned about a volcanic ash plume that rose up to an estimated 20,000 Feet. And not only that, it is moving southeast at 15 knots. So that's pretty good speed. Plus, for the airport, it is a code red on the aviation. That means they would not be able to see it, would not be able to fly. So there's a good chance the airport, if it's not closed already, that it will be closing down again. Now I'm going to put this link in the description for you as well. This stream has been going all day. And as you can see, earlier it started off nice and calm. Wasn't nothing really huge going on. And it had a lot of explosive activity, just like it's been doing every day. And a lot of lava has been getting blown into that channel. And you can see just how fast this lava is flowing right here. All that explosion that's coming up with lava, most of it is landing right here in this channel and flying down this hill. Now it's nighttime over there and I'm sure y'all can see it better than anybody. It is bright, it is shining, and both of, both vents are just shooting up dramatically. And this one is still going from earlier this morning. Still going. Now a little bit of good news. Spain has approved $12.2 million in aid package for La Palma. Over 500 buildings was destroyed so far by the lava flow. Villages of Takande and Tawaya evacuated and it increases explosive activity and new vents and ash plume now four kilometers high. And the new lava flow caused by cone fracture moving is moving more quickly now and more fluidly. And the president of La Palma local government says that the flow is advancing quickly towards the coast. Now as far as the lava flows, one of the lava flows has stopped while the other one is slowly advancing down the slope towards the sea. A place where it is not yet clear if it will reach, but in the last hours there was a strong eruption which created a third lava flow. And I got an update on the shock waves as well, so you can see how long it takes from getting one of these shock waves and just how loud these sounds are these people have been having. That's why it's been rattling their doors and their windows. You can see it on this one. And that just has to be a very scary moment. So God bless you all over there on the Plus, Invulcan made a video showing all this lava going towards the power lines. 
over there by the island and you can see how quickly it's moving across the land and how high up it is it's higher than the power lines this is going to smash everything now the lava map update ever since this morning is expanded even further out but this big hill right here this big mound is where it's at and it's either going to go this way and go towards the ocean or it's going to go this way and go towards the ocean and i got a probability map that shows probability more than likely it will go this way link in the description as well and as you see in this green right here this green is a very low probability of where this lava could flow to the high probability is in this red and you can see how some of it does come towards this side however there's a very low probability right next to the mountain so more than likely it is going to travel this way and go towards the ocean and as you can see here's that hilltop right here that's on that map and so if it travels on this side which is showing as highly unlikely is showing as more than likely will travel on this side and if it travels on this side it will go this way towards the ocean and that would mess up this town right here where if it went on this side it more than likely wouldn't mess as much up of this area but according to the new lava map all this area you're at risk for the lava to be coming towards your direction if it keeps coming and it'll go around that hill now that's the latest update so far i didn't want to drag it on any any longer than it needed i just want to give you exactly the information that is out there and not add anything extra so if you haven't been here and you're from la palma please subscribe because i will be posting videos on this every single day and if updates come where it's different than the morning more active more dangerous or even some good information coming from your help and maybe some homes that's provided for y'all i will give you that information in an afternoon update just to keep you posted thank you so much for visiting my channel guys and if you haven't been here before this is the best part of my channel i will pray for you god bless you may y'all be safe over there psalm 75 unto thee O god do we give thanks unto thee do we give thanks for that thy name is near thy wondrous works declare. When I shall receive the congregation, I will judge uprightly. The earth and all the inhabitants thereof are dissolved. I bear up the pillars of it, Selah. I said unto the fools, deal not foolishly. And to the wicked, lift not up the horn. Lift not up your horn on high. Speak not with a stiff neck. For promotion cometh neither from the east nor from the west, nor from the south. But God is a judge. He putteth down one and setteth up another. For in the hand of the Lord there is a cup, and the wine is red. It is full of mixture. And he poureth out of the same. But the dregs thereof, all the wicked of the earth, shall wring them out and drink them. But I will declare forever, I will sing praises to the God of Jacob. All the horns of the wicked also will I cut off, but the horns of the righteous shall be exalted. Amen. God bless you all tonight. I hope you have a very blessed night tonight. I will update you as usual in the morning on the tropics as well. I'll try and get some more information for you and see exactly what's going on with this help with the homes and see if some land comes with that as well. I do see it's going towards y'all uh, banana crops some. So God bless you, La Palma. Y'all hang tight. Hope you all have a great night tonight. <laughs> all glory does go to Yahweh. God of Jacob, the Almighty. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> Hallelujah, guys. Have a very blessed night tonight. I will see you in the morning.